Hey, hey guys, welcome back to another episode, yo, here from Sir Hermit Crafty. Yeah, <laughs> how is it going? How is it going, guys? Uh, uh, a break of a week now with episodes. I'm sorry about that, but, you know, family first. Uh, for the guys that saw my Twitter post or my community post, I let you guys know. And it's always uh, good, you know, if you wonder where is a video, maybe check a community post. Because normally, if I cannot do a video, I will let you know why. And in case there is none, you know, you, you know. Because <laughs> I also saw a few disappointed Twitter posts. Hey, goat man, where's video? What's up? Lazy? <laughs> no. But amazingly, my mom was here for a full week. Um, because, yeah, Doki is off kindergarten, was off kindergarten. There was a kindergarten, you know, vacation time for a full week. And the plan was to get my mom here, right? So she can play with Doki all the time. But uh, that didn't play out because, well, I rarely see my mom and it was really cool to actually spend time. We have the most beautiful weather. So we ended up going to the swimming pool or do little, you know, trips with Doki. And Doki was the happiest having Omi, how they call my mom. Uh, yeah, in difference to Karen's mom, they call them Oma. So <laughs> there's a difference, Omi and Oma. And at one day, even both Oma and Omi were here and it was the best day ever. And yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, it was just made it impossible. But yeah, I really rarely see my mom. She lives quite far away. And yeah, I, I guess you understand. Um, it sucks, though, to get out of the rhythm. That's for sure. Because, you know, if you're used to the grind and then you stop a week to get back into the grind was really, really difficult. Especially as yes, after a whole week of the kindergarten being closed, right? On the Monday morning, when kindergarten starts up again, you get an email at 7 a.m. in the morning from your kindergarten informing you that they have some sickness uh, cases in there, you know, with the teachers and what, and uh, can only uh, watch Doki half the day instead of the full day. So, yeah, Karen is at work as well, so somebody has to take care of Doki. So, at the moment, I really don't have much time this week because, yeah, well... Kindergarten, once again, has problems with personnel, ah, which is a shame. Um, and, you know, in our kindergarten, it's even going well. Um, yeah. Sucks, but what can you do? I mean, I love spending time with Doki, of course. I mean, you know, I don't mind if they come home from kindergarten earlier. Uh, come, come home. Uh, I have to pick them up, of course. <laughs> which also takes some time. Um, but yeah, unfortunate for video production, I guess. But nevertheless, you know, we got to be smart and use our time wisely this week. And behind me, you see something that is pretty much a consumer of your life. <laughs> But this time, we're going to outsmart the button and anybody else on the server. We're going to goat it. Yeah. But before we go, um, yeah, check this out. Pareo! The thumbnail of the week by trying my worst. Posted over on the Hermitcraft Reddit. Yeah, the Witters and the Vexes. It's the name of this epic piece. Look at it. I mean, yeah, do I have to say anything? Right. <laughs> Pretty, pretty epic, commemorating the moment of last time where we built this insane Wither Reactor extension, which uh, yeah made it possible to create Wither Roses via killing Vexes with a quadruple Wither Skull splitter setup. We called an engine. <laughs> Man, sometimes. <laughs> Anyways, amazing fan art. Thank you so much. Uh, check out the links in the video description, please. As usual. Before we do anything with the button, though, I have a genius plan. I have everything we need in this box to make our life way easier with this whole button situation and outsmart it. We're not going to get consumed by this thing. No, 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 no. Not this time. Well, in a way we will, but in a smart way. Uh, first, though, we need to look for... Yes, there it is. Pearl, I think, built this. And yeah, it is TCG Season 2. And, you know, a lot of cards have been updated with more concisive rules or, you know, just nerfed. <laughs> where, where is Mumbo? It's a prime example for a nerfed card. There he is. Poor Mumbo. So the new Mumbo cards are up there, right? Mumbo in green, I think. Let me quickly read through that. 
So now Mumbo does uh, flip a coin twice at 20 damage for every heads. Total damage doubles if you have at least one other. Okay. At 20 damage for every heads. Okay, so mustache. No, so so 60. Okay, so you can do maximum 120. No. Still 160 damage if you get lucky with it. Okay. All right. But still, yeah, it's no longer 240. It's still one of the most powerful cards. All right, anyways, you know, that is just one example. You know, after Mambo got banned from tournament play, which ruined our whole strategy we've been using the whole first season of TCG, now it's nerfed. Some other cards also got some changes, significant changes. Some others just, you know, got uh, more concise wording. But also with the item cards over there, there's also uh, some changes how certain cards are played and so on. I think shield got also improved and yeah, just more concisive language. And as you know, I have a ton of TCG cards to be precise and brought on. <laughs> it's like five Schalke boxes by now organized with things. But yeah, it's, it's got a little bit complicated, so I needed to organize things. So here is all the things I could bundle, like all my books I have, all my damage re reduction items. Um, all my potions, extra damage dealers. And then here's my main TCG pack. At the moment I have four tokens to spend still. I spent all my tokens already, right? And bought like tons of cards. This is the main deck I wanted to play with at the moment, but I'm still uh, trying around with it. Maybe we can look at it later a little bit and uh, get a chance to play when we have updated our cards. And yeah, here's all my ultra rares and uh, effect cards. You know, are the more rare ones and so on. I got a whole lot and I got a check. And then, of course, tons of hermit cards. Look at that prankster. I already have poultry man. I have goat father. I have, yeah, some good pulls. It was easy to get, uh, kind of get the all a lot of the new cards. The green ones are all new cards. Um, because, yeah, you could buy the only new edition cards and that quickly stocked up. I mean, sometimes I even pulled two green, no, two goat fathers out of one pack at once so yeah and here um we got all the item cards right doubles and so on of all the individual items so there's that and here is laid out all the cards i think that are changed wait what is this the new ones are up there okay ah uh, is this group of four here or what All right, so it's all okay. And down here you return. Oh man, people have been trading out their cards already like crazy. Okay, yeah, I'll 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 get to do that now. Um, I guess I start. So those are untouched. We don't have to do anything with those. I guess I start with yeah effect cards. Yeah. All right, I think I got it all. Man, that took a while. It's like I'm sitting here for half an hour or something going through all cards. But I think we got them all sorted out. I'm going to keep one uh, pre-nerf Mumbo card and one pre-nerf uh, Stress card. Because, yes, yeah, Stress is also nerfed now quite a bit. It's not that YOLO completely knocks out the other Hermit. It is balanced or nerfed. You could say here's the new Stress as well. You can look at it. You and opponent take damage equal to your health. So that's uh, quite different now. You cannot just have stress out there, right? When she takes damage, uh, she only does so much damage to, uh, yeah, she can take out, right? Uh, or dish out, pretty much. So yeah, that's when the old stress was one shot everything. So those two cards I'm gonna put in my TCG museum and keeping them there. So yeah, let's uh, clean that all up and then we go back and um, yeah, talking about museum, I actually wanted to take care of the button today and it seems things are really already escalating with the button. You know, he's like, impulse joint, right? He goes like, hey, oh, oh, recent button reset, I see, smiley. Oh, must have been dark. When I just came on, it was like, you know, it was recently reset, so I didn't do it. So people are onto the button but we gotta out big brain them we'll do that but uh next up um i think we're gonna meet up with cub 
Cup wants to catch a guest. And um, yeah, it's the guest that uh, is somewhere south of <laughs> a Hall of Goat uh, that almost got us. You know, the one uh, we brought up for, for the pranks. And it almost got us when we were flying back here transporting um, the Schalke for the Witter Reactor. <laughs> so last time I saw it, it was um, further away towards this direction here behind Hall of Goat. So let's fly and see if we can see him. Let's turn on hitboxes. That should help to maybe spot him in a distance. But last time I saw him, he was quite far back here. Let's see, he's somewhere, yeah, relatively far even. I mean, I hope, I hope Cub knows where it is. <laughs> um, it's like a ghost. It vanishes it. Uh, it vanishes and then shows up again. It's really, but yeah, somewhere. Man, what's the choppiness again? Every time. Wow. Every time I fly to back here via Scarland, it loads up my client that um, everything dies. Pretty much. <laughs> wow. Last time as well when we flew by here. What is this? It's consistent. Yeah. But I can't see the guest. No idea where it is. No idea. Hopefully, Cup knows. Right, I'm gonna. Him. He's on you. Yeah. Uh, no. Yeah. He's literally okay. ignoring me. Oh, now, oh, now he should be. Yep. Okay. Go. Here we go. Right in. <laughs> oh, he's shooting already. Do you get, do you okay. just try and Dude, the cannon is way <laughs> too close. To just... My job is, is gonna be got him, got him. annoy everybody Hold too. Him. Okay. Nice. Okay, let's see. It's so hard. To... Okay. It doesn't like. You gotta yank. We're gonna like. You have to still yank. You can't just like float with it. Yeah. So I'll get under him and yank, and we'll just like do that one at a time. Yep. Try it. Uh oh, is he on me now? He sort of still towards me. Is he still me. on false? He looks like he's going more towards Doc, is he? It's very hard to tell. Yeah, Three people got him. Yep, there you go. Yanked him down. Nice. Uh, okay, well, thanks again. Doing good. that, that over good. and over again. Yep. He went down yeah. super fast. Then. That's perfect. Yes. He's still talking. He falls, right? He's falls. Still on me, yeah? Stay away from the cannon. Stay north. <laughs> I am staying north. I just feel like he's moving more towards <laughs> you. <laughs> he's not going to fly towards yeah. me. So I kind of have to just. Almost caught me. This is why we brought a ton of fishing rods. Uh, yeah. Ah, it's, yeah, uh, it's kind of cool. it's very <laughs> iffy to yeah. to hang uh, hang up to him in the, in the air. Here. Oh, I think I got him. He's kind of floating away <laughs> from our set. Oh, that was a good nice. yank. Nice, that was good. Okay, you gotta drop down below him go. quite a bit. Where's our pillars? Oh, Where is over he? there. Okay. Oh, there he is. Okay, he hit me. You just got hit. <laughs> <laughs> well, better <laughs> you than the cannon. Yeah, he's kind of drifting, isn't he? Yeah, we're gonna have to start leading him over to the setup. Oh. Oh, I'm fishing rods don't really go that far. Okay. Should put a boat on top of him. And oh, that was a good yank. Very good. That All right. Good. That's what you got to do. Kind of as you're flying away, so you yeah. still have like that momentum. Nice. That's good. That's good. Yeah. There we go. How do you hook That's him up perfect. from on top, best? Yeah, I just been kind of like flying down on him, and then like almost whilst in his head. Yeah. Hook him. Mhm. Mm yeah, that's a good one. Ooh. Rock. <laughs> oh, Thanks, Pied, so much. <laughs> oh, missed him. Could you imagine the forest fire if we had fire ticks? Oh, okay, I'm yeah. Oh, man. Burned down the whole thing. Uh, yank! And oh, that was a bit too late. If you overdo it, it's also not good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you have to sort of time it. Yeah. Yank! Yank! I think, I think mine let go right when I, right when I pulled. That was a good one. Nice. Yoink. Yoink. Nope. All right, I'm getting too aggressive with it. I think. He keeps going back up. Yeah. He is going back up quite often. <laughs> yeah, he always wants to go out. Than when He's we started, already the one, two, three, right? One, one gets it, and then the next one maybe, gets it. Maybe you should try to stay a little bit lower falls if that. I'm trying to, yeah. Uh, but yeah, he will try to stay above. Right <laughs> did I just hook cub? I think he did. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I think we're hooked in, and yank! Okay. Nice. Nice. 
good, good, good. Yeah, we, I guess we're gaining ground slowly but surely. I think we are. Yeah. 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 Oh. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> right in the don't face. Right, don't go in front of his face. <laughs> and oh, yank. Too on. Oh, we nice one. We're definitely getting closer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, I gotta get Only on Hermitcraft. <laughs> <laughs> So cool oh. that he's still alive. Oh, it? it's ha I'm happy that they, go. you know, that'll, that'll go into the museum. <laughs> yeah, yeah. If we can pull this off, I hold mean, on, no, don't get out of yourself. Yeah. We'll pull it off. I feel like he's what the same level he's always been at. Oh getting, man. Getting lower? <laughs> I think it is a little, a little bit lower. I feel like you need to be hitting more of uh, the fisher mods, right? Hard to yeah. tell, I'm like swinging around like crazy, so. It's hard to. Sometimes when you when you hooked way. up to him, you kind of stay on his hitbox even a little bit. Oh, you can good, stand on top of him. It was like a double pull. Yeah. Ooh. Right, Cub? Did you and I hit that? I I, I was time? in there too. Might have been. Uh, yeah. Okay. I think that definitely helped. It'd be hard to coordinate, but. Yo. Oh, that yanked him right out of my. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> that's good. That's good. If we have a double hook. We might have to do like a countdown. He's so close to the... I have so sweaty palms. He's so oh, close to I the cannon, man. It freaks me out like crazy. He's floating towards yours. He, oh, he heard you. Go away. He's still uh, facing the other way, but... I feel like I want to stand over at the cannon and play gas tennis. That's why I'm trying to stay a little bit up. Because then he at least is not aiming towards the floor, right? Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, nice one. Good one. He's go, he goes... Oh, he another one. ruins all your progress in like one second. <laughs> He does oh. not want to go down. If the cannon blows up, I'm gonna lose. Then I feel like I feel like the minecart rail should have been. And I have nothing higher. to lose. Then I'll blow <laughs> know, up the right? server. Maybe we like... should have stacked up higher. Maybe we, we still can. Like at this can bring one up. Oh, am I on his right. head? I'm on. I'm on. Okay, you double yeah, stack on. Stack up like good, super high, good, just like good. right under him. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we, we could. Under. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm stacking. I'm gonna get blocks, and I'm gonna try to get up to you okay. guys there. Okay. Doc, watch out for the fireballs, by the way. I'm not going yeah. to exactly. <laughs> it should He's survive a hit. Come on. Okay. Here we go. Over here. here. Good, that's good, that's good. Right, get, get yes, a yes. down Okay, I'm going to try to get the rail going. But he's floating that way. Go! <laughs> All right. Hey. So, in theory, if you, if you get him over yeah, here yeah. somehow. Then we, you know, okay. if we have him close, oh, that was nicely down, and he went up right away. Yeah, now he can see. Why is he going over there? Come here, here, uh. Gasty, come. <laughs> come, 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 come. No, no, come, let's do an pearl. Dang it! What you happened? Oh. You threw it be on the ground oh somewhere, and I'm stuck. Uh. It. There we go. I'm in the water. <laughs> come so here, little Throw. Gasty. Yes. Yeah, I got him. Okay, got we, him. I mean, I can try to right like, right come towards you a little bit more. Yeah. I'm trying to get him to do that. Now he's like too low, what? Now he's too low. I mean, we, we could go we for almost, the original. We okay, almost, go for the original, go for the original. We almost have him down there, yeah. Yeah, try, try I'll keep it right going now. For the oh, I have the perfect... If he, goes, okay. if he goes up too much, then we go for the other one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll... Okay. I'll, I'll yeah, try, try to go over his head, and then if he floats back up, yeah. grab him with your stock. Yeah, okay. okay he's here. Okay, ready? He, he'll, he'll do the height, he'll keep him a little bit lower, and then... If you can't, oh, no, no. yeah, we'll pull him back this way. Oh. Into a duck. Okay, I'm gonna sleep real quick. Yeah, he's he's almost at the end of this pillar, duck. Yeah, quickly gonna sleep. Okay. We're good. Then we can pull him here from the platform. We should be able to hold oh, him nice. here, right? Okay. Should I try? Mm -hmm. I'll I'll try to set up the minecart thing here. Nice, Maybe nice. Simple. Somehow. Yeah, he's here. floating too high, so. Oh. I'm this around one. on a rock. Okay. Yeah. Oh, he's getting close, real close. There. Real close. Put him in. Uh, in fishing rod. I need, a, I need a fishing rod. He's so close. Oh. <laughs> no. Get him in there. Hold on. Get him out of fishing oh, no, he's rod. flying that way now. I have no more fishing no. rods. Did he more ra uh, rails, Doc? I have him. I have him. I he have did? him here. Is he in? Oh, oh, I'm oh, close, no. close, close. I'm gonna... We, we, if he gets somehow close to the platform, 
We can, you know, we can grab him from the platform. Then it's easier. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, so close. Person ready with the oh, minecarts and yeah. stuff. Yeah. I want them. Yeah, just yeah, got it. Constantly yeah. on the. He's right so not there. Doing there we go. Oh, he's like right here. Oh. Yeah, I have him. Help put me. The minecart down. Hook up. We need to pull him. He's right there. Oh, oh he just goodness. hit me. We need to pull him. Minecart, come here. No, oh, he's going away. Pull him, cut! Get in there! Oh, right it's so close! Oh, you pulled him the other way. The minecart needs come to be on. moving. He will, he will not go in like this. Yep. You hold him, Impas. The minecart needs to be okay. moving. Yep, get the minecart moving. Move it, move it, move it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I got him right here. Push it, push it. Push it, push it. Oh, he's right here! Come on! No! Mission run! No! no. Wrong time. Yeah, we need a circle, man. We were on the way to my circling minecart oh, back no, here. No, no, then no, you no. pulled the other way. Right, we need to go in a circle. Oh. I'm making a circle. I'm making a circle. Yeah. Making a circle. We need two people on him. We need two people on him. He's yeah. going up. He's going up. Yep. I'm trying to bring him back. Going away now right. again. Imagine oh, I see him. I see him. It, solo. <laughs> it was so close. Uh, Where's all I see him. I see him. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Kidding me. He almost flew into the upper <laughs> thing himself. Like. I told you he was going to park himself. Uh. Oh, man. <laughs> Uh, okay. Alright, wrong. Okay. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. Where's this guy? He's on you, Cub? He's close. He's close. He's so close. Right, let's, let's finish the job. It's time. Okay, we need to pull him down a little bit. I'll stay here. Oh, yes. It's looking good. A little bit more. Come on. Yes. I can't reach him yet. Okay. I got him oh, here! Pretty pretty I got good. him here! Oh my god. Pull him down again. Oh, he was so no. close. What the? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Oh. Y Yoink! Get him over. Stop. Okay. Get him. I can't reach him. Oh. oh. There he goes. There he goes. Yeah, you got it. C come here. Oh. Yes, yes, yes. That's it. Here we go. Here we go. Pull him. Don't you fight us! Oh. We will get our way! We will get our way! So close. Right, Cubby's on you. Cubby's yeah, yeah, on you. <laughs> More space here with the platform. So cramped. How come? And... Yes. Okay, we got him down okay. a bit. A bit over. Double pull, nice. Nice. I mean, the, if you have him low, it doesn't matter. If he comes back up... It's, I mean, right. Yes. No. Come here, come here. Yes. Can't reach him yet. <laughs> go this way. Got him. I got him. Oh. Somebody come with me on the platform and pull. Yep. We need to pull over. Can't let him get away. Okay, keep on pulling. Impulse. Don't look where you're going. It's. Oh, come on. No, the no, fishing rod broke. Are you kidding me? Come on, both of them. No. Come stay that way. Come stay. What? That way. Come on. A little bit over. Keep it. Keep it up. Yeah. Oh, okay, no. pull, fall, you pull, pull. You got, it, you got it, you got it. Oh no. What? <laughs> of all the times we both oh, break our fishing rod, are you kidding me? Okay. So close. Uh, no. Okay. A little bit. Ah! <laughs> so close. Oh, good one. Gonna pull him over. Can you reach him, Doc? Where is he? He's way below now. He's under you. He's under you. He's Can't he's get playing. him. Oh, he's, oh, he's, he's on going. The other one. He's going. Oh, he's on the other Go one. Go up. Go up. Just touch it. Pull him over. Oh, my God. I can't. What is he doing? Oh, we got him. We got oh. him. Keep, keep, keep him attacked. Pull him. He's right here. It's so close. Pull him. Doc. Couldn't get him. Oh my gosh, he was almost touching the cart. Uh, that was, that so, was close. so close. <sighs> that was a good oh. pull. Very good pull. Mm -hmm. Can't reach him. Oh, good one. Ah, oh, come on. 
Yes, you got him. And there you go. Got him again. He's so close! Get him! Get him in! Alright, stop moving though. No! Come on! Yes! He's in the cart! He's Get away! Hey. Let's go! <laughs> to the base station! Let's back to the go. base station! Alright, yeah, yeah, go back to the base oh station. Oh my goodness. Going <laughs> oh. away. Going oh, away. That was Flying away. Oh, oh my gosh. Ooh. That was intense. Oh. Let me go by and what? see him in there. He, oh, yeah, he's in there. He's in there. He's good. Oh. He's good. He didn't come out. Oh. Yes. What Dude. the world? <laughs> Teamwork. Really difficult. Oh. Oh, <laughs> oh, man, oh my god. <laughs> that is insane. I'm going to see if I can see him with the spyglass. Let me see if I can get close enough. Oh, I'm going to free cam over Oh, there. my gosh. Yeah. Good I job, guys. Sweaty. Good that job. That was so rough. That oh, yeah, there he is. I see him. Yep. Oh. There he is. Oh, my <laughs> goodness. <laughs> Okay, he's not taking any damage, right? Yeah, no. If you, if you, no, he's good. He's hanging. He's yeah. good. He's good. I can, I can go invisible and get him from there. I think. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> I, I'm most likely. Uh, you want to drop him down, man. You know, build the minecart track below. Yeah. And then just True. mine, mine yeah. away the stuff, and then it'll drop down. I guess, but. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, there's a lever on the side. He's, I don't know. Ah, <laughs> uh, we got. Maybe you can turn off the power rail so he's stationary. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Don't know. Yeah, I'll figure out something. Oh, okay. but that's, that's <laughs> the main job, thing. Just getting him catching. Oh. Him, Good job. <laughs> yeah, with the applause, with the applause. Good job, guys. Wow. Uh, Thank you guys so much for the help. Oh my God, there's no way I could have done that <laughs> myself. Seriously, that was oh, it took wanna, all four of us. It, just oh, <laughs> hey, hey, but don't forget <laughs> no to clean up my backyard, right? <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. You yeah, want to go check your redstone? Make sure it didn't get hit. Ah, dude. Okay, yeah. You're actually right. We gotta, tr we gotta basically alert strange. everybody, Etho, Joe, whoever is like living in this section of the server, like to the, what is it, west? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Shall we go load it in <laughs> now and check some... if we can see any fireballs? I mean, I, be some fireballs. I see no fireballs and no fires. <gasps> oh, oh, no, you dare. No, 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 no. He's lying. No, I'm not Wait. lying. Wait, no, where? Oh, Doc. No, he got what? hit by a gas ball. I'm not making it up. There's a fire where? on top of it. Where, where? Yeah, I'm panicking. <gasps> oh my what? god, there oh, is. No. Oh no. Oh no. What? No. Is it Tell just me. fire? Oh. It's okay. It's, it's, I'm it's looking. Okay. I need to look it at things. Set off that it blew up right? two. It it blew up two rail tracks. Oh okay, my okay, gosh. Okay. Wow. Easy repair, though, at least. Oh, I'm thinking nothing about this thing is easy. Oh. I need to call oh, no. in the hive mind. I don't know what happens if I update this observer here where the fire is oh, on. No. Oh, no. Right. Oh, yeah, can you, you can probably remove the redstone block. No, I don't know. Not, yeah, yeah. Let's see that redstone no. block. I'll, I'll, I'll look into it. Let's, uh, I'll figure it out. It's needed. Unreal, uh, it, it like actually got hit. Oh, I, but it didn't blow up. Oh, my, oh, my heart. <laughs> hopefully hopefully it's easily repairable oh man yeah, i think it should so. be it's just detector tracks on Ooh. top there I it mean, blew off some yeah. glass here i think too what the heck oh my god this is there's not insane. even any nearby either that must have been just one i know how gospel. random come there's on no near. i don't see any oh. fire anywhere else no. this crazy yeah. <laughs> okay. We tried. Uh, I think the dust did that. Maybe we, we should have built that wall I was talking about. <laughs> maybe we should have. Yeah. Oh man. Uh, okay. I'll I'll, I'll <laughs> look into it. I'll I'll fix it. No worries. All right. Good All luck. Right. I pulled a good world download we yesterday tried. actually to tr test something, so I have a good reference. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Nice. All right. <laughs> Uh, okay, good thanks luck. again guys thanks yeah. again clean up the backyard yeah, i need to fun. yep we'll clean it up we'll clean it up i need to <laughs> sleep stuff. now or something and recover that was whoa it actually hit the cannon <laughs> unreal what a freak accident and we got so lucky oh my god can't believe it actually did hit the cannon it didn't blow up this is one of the rare spots it could be hit without blowing up actually Okay, let me see. Yeah, that should be no problem. Okay, yeah. Should be 
didn't trigger anything down here as far as I can tell. This would update those pistons. Okay, this looks I think it looks all good. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy crap. Now we need to spawn proof here. And the rest is fine. Yeah, it hit right here on the glass block, man. I, if it would have taken out this one here, we're talking real problem. <laughs> like this being pulled back kind of didn't really do anything without the other... Oh, <laughs> oh, that was pure luck. Yo, okay. I think we should be good. Yeah, we should be good. I have to check later though again and see if part <laughs> uh, <laughs> I hope nothing else was hit. I mean, you know, one redstone that does that's missing somewhere here and you know we are in problem town. Yeah. But for now I cannot spot any more damage. I'll have to look into it later, but it's Hermitcraft for you. There's always distractions. We were on to a completely different project here today. You know, the button. We looked at it already. We got to take care of that. So I'm already seeing, like, for example, suspiciously, too much green camera account being on all the time. So that means green probably has his cam account sitting over there at the button watching it. So people are pretending maybe they're not really into it, but they're watching it. It's very suspicious to have Green's cam account on all day. I think what he's trying to do is trying to load it, keep it loaded so it runs faster, right? That's a, in principle a good idea. Okay, it's here. Whoa, the choppiness when you fly into spawn, holy moly. Okay, here it is, and here's the crowns. At the moment, there's like next to no progression going on. So the rare time I had when I was chilling, um, doing you know daddy, daddy action with Doki and mom and yeah whatnot, um, I thought about this a little bit and here and there looked at it and pretty much it's relatively simple. Up here, this hopper, the fuller this hopper is, the further this will progress the more of these lights will turn off. And eventually, when this light turns off, we reach the phase with the three last lights where you get the best crown. The mechanic of the thing is like this. If it goes all the way down to purple and you press it, you will get all the diamonds. So three from here, one diamond block, plus the three diamond blocks over there, and all three crowns. So they will be dispensed to roughly about here with a slight modification we will do to the system. Nobody will recognize. And this time we're big braining it. Check it out. I dug a huge hole <laughs> below here. And now we secretly need to install a system um, that will help us outsmart everybody. So. We're gonna use Enderpearl Stasis Chamber in combination with uh, End Portal, uh, with Nether Portal, and so on. And um, via that, we will be we will be able to teleport here at any time. Snack, even if another hermit presses. Okay, let's let's close that off. I think it was. Oh, it's just this. Okay, all right. We're gonna install that system here, and then when it gets into critical phase, it you know. Boom, we pop up here, right here, where the crown will fall. We snack the crown and, you know, we also we need to align ourselves in a way that we can press this button. But I have an idea for that as well. So I guess, I don't know, first thing is first, we need stasis chamber down here. Did I have a few torches here? Yeah, I do. Okay. But I can hear slime. Or is it spider? What's going on here? All right area below spawn nothing is lit up or explored here yeah that's slime chunk I see 
Okay, so yeah, we're right here, right below the button. And yeah, let me let me start building here a little bit. And then we need to do some testing and fiddling. And hopefully we get it to work in a way that uh, will make us the ground king of the server. All right. <gasps> Oh, <laughs> all right, he says. And there's a creeper in the system. Okay, we need some light up here. Where's my bow? <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, that definitely needs some fixing. I have one more torch on me? Of course not. I never have torches on me. Okay, I need to light it up up here. Maybe oh, there's way too many here. We can, we can snack one and place it somewhere over there. Yeah, and then we should be good. Okay. Good. Good. The other hermits spammed torches down here when they was building the street. I think it was Ren. All right. So what do we have here now? We have here a classic ender stasis chamber where we will uh, keep one of our ender pearls, but it is connected to an ender pearl bouncer right away. So... You know, when this triggers, and yeah, it will trigger, I haven't hooked it up to trigger, but when it's done, it will trigger either if you reach purple and we're ready to get everything, or if somebody presses the button, uh, we will also be called here to see what's up and maybe snipe whatever they get. <laughs> but um, yeah, let's test it. And um, yeah, this is how we load it. We come over here, we want to align the pearl nicely. So uh, scoot all the way over and forward. Look straight down, shoot the pearl and step back a bit. Nice. And now we just flick this lever and uh, that holds the pearl here nicely. Yes, that's what we want to see. The pearl in there nicely being pushed down and perfectly balanced between an upward draft here from the bubble column and a downward suction. And it's just sitting there perfectly in the middle. If you trigger this thing, the piston will push it which will not trigger the ender pearl. Normally you would think if it touches something, it will always go off, not if a piston pushes it. So we can bring it over here and then we launch it uh, up with the slime block right away. And then we have a, a block remover and retractor. It will pull out this block here, which is straight in front of the, the whole setup there. So yeah, now ender pearl is loaded and we can trigger the whole thing and see if we get properly teleported and we will always end up at the same spot um, so yeah, if that gets triggered, the whole thing should go off. Yes. Okay. And we will always be here. I mean, we can reach the button. And now we need to take some notes. Um, okay. Here, if you, you have the angle up there. You can see minus it's facing south towards positive set and then it says minus six and yeah we can do minus six and minus twelve you can easily remember that right and then wherever we afk we just look exactly like this minus six minus twelve oh my god something like that but yeah we know that okay minus six minus twelve is the angle we need to look at our afk station all right, so now so we know this thing works. Let's, uh, oh, I think it progressed at the moment one bit. Let's uh, try it out again. Um, how well can we get in? I mean, in theory, we could get in here, right? Yeah. Okay, and then we just put the block back up. And then I'll look with, um, you know, camera mode so you can actually see um, what's going on here with the setup. It's pretty cool. So let's get the ball, okay, get the ball rolling again, all the way to the right, forward, straight down, boom, and the pearl in, okay, there she bounces, boom, pushing her over, let's check, ah, it's a bit too high, so we want to trigger that thing again, so the ender pearl is nicely submerged, yep, exactly like that, that's what we want to see. All right, and now I'm just gonna go here, and then we're gonna mine this block again, like this, and uh, yeah, coming up like that, and then you shall see. Oh. 
Wait. Oh, wait. I could hear... I can hear an endomite. Couldn't I? I did just hear an endomite. I'm pretty sure there was an endomite in the system. That, of course, is... Uh, yeah, there it is. Okay, okay. So we spawned an endomite in there that deflected the pearl. <laughs> okay, we need to make sure we don't have one in there when we when we use that thing. All right, let's let's load it again. <laughs> yeah, I thought I heard an endomite when he, uh, but I was like, nah, it was nothing. We're good. <laughs> Not really. Okay, let's try again. Uh, all the way to the corner, straight down. Boof, and the pearl goes in. Okay, there's no no endomite. Okay. Yeah, pearl is good like this. Okay, and now let's go back over there again. And um, we place a block and then we check again. <laughs> yeah, mind like crazy. Okay, we just need to right click. Okay, let's check it out. Boom. Pearl gets shot up. Boof, and we get teleported to here. Nice. And now let's check. I didn't move yet. Let's check on our angles. If we look at roughly, yeah, minus 6 and minus 12, we would hit the button here if you have auto right click activated. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Now there's only one thing to do pretty much. We need to wire this to the whole contraption. And it should be pretty easy to pull a signal out of this here. And nobody will know we're we messed with it a little bit. We will not change the redstone here or anything. So, you know, we will just add a little something. And that is, yeah, right here. Right here we will pull a signal with a piston downwards. And, um, yeah, then go from there. All right up a little chunk loader here otherwise none of this makes any sense and yeah i gotta test it now so when the setup is on let's see nice all right yep we're up and running here okay so whenever we have an endopearl in the stasis chamber this is loaded and turn it off again perfect and that loads the whole button here in the area and yeah, I have the connection to the main system here now as well. Um, so very simple. Here is just an observer. Um, pretty much that gets pushed down by piston and node block. And it's sitting right here. So when, we reach, when this goes off, only the last three lights will be on and we are in purple rain. All right, so it's hooked up here. And you know, I even used some... <laughs> some pink concrete, uh, probably not even a mumbo will recognize that this doesn't belong. And then below here we have hidden, and um, you can see the piston here. It's also a note block piston observer, same trigger. And um, if somebody presses the button, um, if we have an ender pearl loaded, we will also show up and land right perfectly in front. And hopefully, um, by doing so, snacking um, the crown away, even, you know, if another hermit presses. <laughs> like, we will end up right here and the pearl will shoot out and fly straight towards us. Probably other hermit is here. Yeah. But there is a chance we snag it. That's for sure. Maybe the inventory is full, you know. We, got, we, we have a chance. So, um, yeah, last thing we need now is pretty much an AFK station with a little twist to it. All right, and here we are over at the perimeter, uh, just below the dragon. And that area here is chunk loaded anyways, you know, because here, right, there's a chunk loader hidden here that keeps the dragon in place. And so, yeah, we have this area loaded here. And what we will do is we load the station at spawn, then that is chunk loaded, this area is chunk loaded as well. And then we just come in here, we um, take an ender pearl, throw it in there. Boom, to load this chamber here, okay. And then we do our thing, right? We look at minus six, minus 12, roughly. 
and then we would uh, activate automated uh, uh, periodic use. That means, you know, boom, as soon as the thing over there triggers, we get teleported there and would automatically press the button, get all the crowns, and then, of course, we want to get out of there again. We don't want to just hang out, right? And this is what this is doing. So as soon as we get teleported away by the end of Pearl over at spawn, we go off this pressure plate, and after a short delay, but like, I don't know, 10-ish seconds or so, we will be teleported back. So now we are at spawn, right, doing our thing, pressing buttons, and this stays chunk-loaded, boom. Now it just ran out, and uh, yeah, we're back here again. And hopefully our inventory is filled with beautiful crowns. That is the plan. So now I just need to clear out my inventory, clean everything up here a little bit, and um, then go to the spawn area, go to the button, load that bad boy, and, um, you know, then we AFK. <laughs> Not obsessed with the button at all. Not obsessed. <laughs> yes! Oh my god! Yes! <laughs> it worked! I've got all the crowns! I win! Yes! <coughs> it just woke up. <coughs> oh. Yes! Okay, I'm in here. I have all the crowns, all the items on me. Okay, I... I okay, okay. I let, I let the recording run all night. Oh my god, we succeeded. Okay, so let's see how to... Let's, let's, let's check the footage. Alright, so here's the footage of us. Sitting there AFK. Yeah. Somewhere in the middle of the night. It's raining. Oh, yeah, okay. Got teleported. Boom. Instantly pressed. Yep. <laughs> Everybody dispensing us. Oh, okay. Phantom spawned on top of us because it was in the night. Boom. And we get teleported back into the safety. Wow. That's crazy. <laughs> it worked. Oh man. Yes. Okay. Nicely reset it. Everything fine. Oh my god. This is so cool. <laughs> okay, let's get down there. And oh wait. That was the way back here. Turn off the chunk loader and now. We couldn't forget about this button for the rest of our lives. We defeated it. <laughs> oh, look at them crowns. We gotta try them out now. All right. Okay. We'll be coming over here. Up. Oh, crap. Let's climb up here real quick. Turn off the chunk loader. And everything. Man, it's choppy again out around here at spawn. All right, then. <laughs> oh, this is so awesome. <laughs> nice. Uh, we defeated the button with big brain moves. Very happy about that. Oh, yeah. This is looking fine. Ah, a nice add-on here to our trophy room. It's getting somewhere, you know, we're getting really meaningful trophies here, not just random items, like everything we have here. There's a meaning, this is a, f you know, a f for the feud with hot guy and scar blowing up my, my tunnel bore and so on, the Easter egg hunt. You know, now our great achievement of getting the crowns, the Ender Dragon we brought to the overworld was here, which we have at the moment, uh, yeah, given to um, Cub for the museum. We need to visit the museum, man. Things are happening there. He's got a guest now. I wonder if he took him away already. 
But yeah, anyways, we're gonna uh, walk around with these crowns and stand on the hermits. Probably I'm gonna start off with the smallest one. And people are like, yeah, well, okay. Potentially some other hermits have these crowns as well already. And then, you know, we can crazy stand on them just like, oh, okay, you think this is a crown? This is a crown. <laughs> All right, uh, let's take a quick nap here. And um, then... Yeah, obviously I use the invisible item frames, right, to attach the crowns and the diamonds and stuff. Let's quickly fly back and see if Cup actually took the ghast out already. And uh, while we de go there, here, comment of the week. Uh, I wish Doc would do this uh, his intro in German for once, just for fun, uh, by Garrett. <laughs> actually a fun comment. Uh, I have to laugh about it, uh, just thinking about it. Uh, the story I want to tell you in relation to that, man... Okay, yeah, the gas is gone and everything is cleared, cleaned up already. See, Cup. Cup is a grinder. I need to do a sorrow check on the cannon, though. Um, I have a world download. Yeah, there's also some... Yeah, it shot all over the place, man. No damage here at the Wither Reactor, though. Man, that was risky catching that gas. So, yeah, about the German stuff. <laughs> So a few years back, right, me and Pommes Peter were chilling and were thinking, man, you know, if you look around in, you know, YouTube uh, Germany, like their Minecraft content, um, no disrespect to other content creators now, right, but it's not really innovative. It seems um, a lot of what they do is they check the international English-speaking community and see what's kind of going on there and then replicating that um, a little bit in their videos, but there was, you know, uh, you couldn't say there was a hardcore, crazy German-speaking technical scene, which is kind of crazy because a lot of the Hive Mind members uh, are actually, you know, German mother tongue speakers, not only Germans, but, you know, so uh, in, in Tech Minecraft, Germany plays a big role, but not, uh, there's not many good German technical Minecraft videos for some weird reason. Everybody is in the English community because, yeah, just like me, it's just better to work in this great, um, you know, big Minecraft universe and not be stuck with your language. And English is kind of the international language of Minecraft in a way. And, um, yeah, so it is only logical to also join the international community and not do videos in German. But still we thought, hey, maybe we can help out the German-speaking community a bit, those people who don't really watch English or can't understand English. The thing is, though, in Germany, pretty much anybody speaks English, especially younger people, so they can, you know, understand and watch these videos in English too, of course. As many of you probably are watching from German-speaking countries right now or maybe, you know, you're from Sweden or somewhere else, but you're watching in English. Everybody watches YouTube in English. It's kind of a thing. I don't know. So Pommes and I go like, hey, let's do German videos. And I tell you, we tried to do the intro. We had like 20 takes or something and then we just gave up and buried the idea of doing German videos forever <laughs> because it was terrible. Like when I do my videos here in English, like it's completely natural. It feels just fine. You know, I go like, hey, hey guys, welcome back to another Hermitcraft, uh, you know, or whatever. Hey, hey guys, alone dead. Just comes easy and feels totally cool. And guys is a perfect word. It describes all of you, you know, uh, is uh, yeah that a, a word like that probably doesn't even properly exist in German. German is very descriptive, and then things such sound weird. Like you know, I would then was thinking, okay, how what, what do we say for the intro? Is it hi Leute? Oh my God! When I heard that, that sounds so cringe. No, it feels so weird. And then we finally, I don't know, agreed that we would just do hey hey guys <laughs> in English. <laughs> And then continue in German, right? And then we go like, hey, hey, guys. Heute sind wir hier, um euch zu zeigen, wie man eine Eisenfarm baut. And then, poof, we had to cut the video already because we couldn't hold it together and had to giggle uh, because we knew soon I'm going to say, instead of Piston, I'm going to say Kolben. That's uh, how, uh, you know, Piston is named in, in German. <laughs> Kolben. And, uh, you know, we couldn't get over this word. And then we said, let's keep it Piston. And it was a just terrible, you know, terrible, an absolute disaster. And just doing the intro, we were there for two hours and we had nothing. And we were just like, nah, not going to happen. So, in short... I tried once a few years ago to do a German video and then learned I will never do it again, ever. I hated every second of it. It felt unnatural, it felt cringe, and I'm very happy to do my videos in English. And I don't care if I'm sometimes, I don't know, 
have maybe less words, uh, less fancy words to use. Of course, if I would use my mother tongue, I could speak differently, I guess. But, you know, for me, my Minecraft life is associated with English. We talk English all the time with my friends. Um, I'm working on projects, we talk English. Even sometimes, you know, we are together with the hive mind. We're like four Germans in the room. We still talk English <laughs> because we're talking about Minecraft, right? So it's, uh, yeah, to me, speaking English and Minecraft is deeply, deeply connected. It's one. And I cannot even imagine in my wildest dreams to do German videos. Um, so, yeah. There's that, and I hope you enjoyed the episode today. Um, let's see what we do next week. I have plenty of pro projects lined up, but now as we have the button out of the way, I think um, nothing will hinder our productivity. Um, yeah. I don't know how often I said it this season. It's the Hermitcraft. Things happen. <laughs> All right. See you next time. Bye, guys. <laughs>